Hello, Jacob. Hello, Daniel. How are you? I'm doing pretty good today. How about yourself? Excellent. I'm great, thank you. All right. This week we have an article on the solar rebate. Yes, we do. The uh, The title is actually Understanding the Federal Government Solar Rebate in Australia, the STC Scheme in 2024. Um, a lot of folks, um, when they're searching uh, information about the solar rebate, they don't always Google it correctly because it's technically called the Small Scale Technology Certificate, right? That's correct. Small Scale yep. Technology STC. Certificate, STC. Um, and it's this wonderful scheme that the federal government has set up to benefit uh, solar customers. Yes. Um, it works. Uh, uh, incredibly well. What happens is uh, there are these virtual certificates that are like tokens uh, that are uh, purchased by companies. It's obviously based on the system size. As Mm -hmm. you know, the more um, kilowattage of of output that your system has, the more rebate that you're entitled to because, again, it offsets what the big polluters are doing. But it equates to currently somewhere around 4,000 for our average system size of around 10 or 11 kilowatts, 400 big thousand. It's it's, it's four and change Mm. for, I think, what, 11, 12, something like that, which is our average. There's obviously a lot happening in the space of rebates. And just to be clear, this is the solar rebate as we know it in New South Wales currently uh, in 2024 because every December 30, first it goes down by mm-hmm. a one fifteenth. yeah let's kick it off with some fundamentals of the solar rebate so who's eligible to get the solar rebate well anybody who is purchasing solar is eligible for the solar rebate you have to be have to have a rooftop in australia that solar is going on uh and and that's basically it you know it's nothing the customer has to do that's really important to mention uh this transaction happens between the solar installer and the big bag polluters um the solar installer um sells those stc certificates on behalf of the uh, system that they are installing for the customer. And then the polluters pay the solar installer company. That's just kind of how it shakes out. In the form of the certificates. Right. So so they're basically buying the certificates off a solar installer. Yeah. The certificates are issued Mm -hmm. based on the panels and the output of the system that you've provided. Yeah. Um, And usually that's done by a middleman Mm -hmm. called the... um, STC aggregator, I think Mm -hmm. they're called. You're right to absolutely bring up uh, how it's constantly in flux and constantly changing the price of individual STCs. We could get into that, but really it's just a big chunk of money that is the rebate that is comprised by this whole system. And that chunk of money is based on the size of the system, which we mentioned, but the size of the system is important because it's uh, per megawatt hours that system will potentially produce. What they predict that system will produce energy-wise over 25, 30-year period. Yeah, Mm -hmm. it's lifetime. Uh, Also, the location, how many peak sun hours uh, a home is getting. I know a lot of the advertisements that we see very loud on social media have people kind of yelling about zip codes. And that is determined by sunshine that those four zones get. Obviously, Northwest Territory is going to get a lot more sunshine than Tasmania. So they're awarded different. Uh, STC values. So Jacob, what's the process for someone to claim the rebate? Well, Dan, it's real easy. Uh, Essentially, you just have to get your quotes uh, about what type of system you're interested in. You can get that uh, from any solar installer, but there are companies specifically designed to put you out with quotes to different installers like solar quotes or solar choice. Um, you take those quotes, you'll make some phone calls or they'll make phone calls to you usually more accurately. Yeah. Um, and then you figure out who you want to get to install your system. You purchase your system and then your installer takes care of your rebate for you. Uh, at Penra Solar Center, it is an upfront discount. Uh, that we automatically take off. So the pricing that we put up there reflects that. It's it's important if somebody is looking at solar to install sooner rather than later, because as you mentioned, it is decreasing every year until 2030. That will be the last year it's available. Um, So uh, the longer you wait on solar, the longer you're investing in the grid, and the longer or the smaller your rebate will be. The slice of the rebate. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Awesome, mate. Well, thank you. Great article. And um, yeah, I hope that helps people understand it. what the rebate's all about. Yeah, for sure, Dan. Thank you. Cheers.